Hi, you reached Mara. Don't leave a message because I never check my voicemail. Phoenix rising from the ashes? Um, it's abstract. Ah, oh, very cool. Are you free to grab dinner later? I have rehearsal, so... Right. So when are you free? Um... Because last week you missed dinner because you were busy, and I'm going to New York on Friday for yeah, an interview. congrats. Thanks. Um... <clears throat> I should probably get back to this. The, um, the finals next week, so... Okay. Right. But text me, okay? So what should I do? I don't know. I mean, did he seem upset last time you saw him? No, not really. Uh, okay, maybe he's mad that you got drinks with that 30-year-old staffer. Oh my. I told him it was a networking thing. He's not mad. Okay, I mean, why else would he be ghosting you? What if he just wants to be left alone? What? What? Yeah, what, what if he's busy and just doesn't want to hang out? People are allowed to do that. Mara, what are you talking about? Max is Ethan's boyfriend. Yeah, and, and how long have you been together? Six months? Sometimes people just lose interest. Like, they can be interested in other things. Isn't it rude of Max to not even respond? Maybe we're all overthinking this. Um, I have to go to class. with you? Nothing. You've been blowing me off for days, ignoring my texts, and then yesterday at the lawn? Alex, it's... Is this because of Sam? Because I feel like ever since you guys got together, I just, I hardly see you anymore. No, it's not because... Every time I reach out, you have rehearsal, or a painting to finish, or Sam's coming over, or some bullshit. So anything that doesn't involve you is bullshit? It's not what I said. Remember we used to make fun of those people? Who act like they were best friends when they saw each other but never actually hung out? Yeah, I feel like that's what this is turning into. Not everything's about you. Hey, Lexi. I'm calling because I know you're really bad at responding to texts. Uh, but I was wondering if you wanted to go to a party tonight. It'll be super fun. It's at Blue AG 201. It's the really uh, cute guy's house. <laughs> so. Uh, yeah, let me know, um, but I'll hope to see you there. Yeah, I know, I know. Okay, so be careful, be careful. Oh, I can sit down, it's fine. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. We'll, oh, it's okay. We'll go sit over there, okay? Okay, okay here you go, here you go.
just don't get it. Don't get what? Why Mera's acting so... She used to be the funniest, most nicest person. We got through freshman year and then sophomore year together. And now she thinks she's better than me because she's gonna become some big actress or painter and I'm just boring. You're not boring. Yeah, but Mary thinks so. You know what she texted me? She said, I care about you, but I don't think I can be your friend anymore. Ouch, that sucks. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry, you're nice. Not like Mara. <laughs> Thanks for staying out here with me. Yeah, of course. Are you kidding me? Hey. What's wrong? You should talk tomorrow. Tomorrow, when you're feeling better, okay? Wait. Yeah. I forgot my purse. Okay, yeah. We can, we, we can just go, go. Oh, Will you leave me alone? What did you end up doing with it? Did you keep it abstract? Yeah, mostly. I added some like feathery strokes, so it kind of looks like a phoenix now. Okay. Yeah. Can't wait to see it. Yeah. I can't tell if I should be feeling happiness or despair. It's very monk. So mm -hmm. 